You might think that transforming a modest sum into 10 times its amount sounds like a tall order. But what if I told you it's not only possible, it's been done before. And we're here to show you how you can do it too. Let's rewind the clock to 1978. Hillary Rodham Clinton, long before becoming the first lady of the United States, embarked on a financial adventure with just $1,000 in her grasp. In a daring move, she plunged into some daring investment at the time when most people end up losing their shirt. Yet against all odds, in just a few months, she multiplied her investment to nearly $100,000. Now you might be wondering, how does this relate to me? Here's the thing. Today, with more resources, tools, and opportunities at our fingertips than ever before, turning $1,000 to a $10,000 is not just a dream. It's a very attainable goal. We're living in a time where the investment landscape is rich with possibilities, from the stock market and real estate to cryptocurrencies and beyond. In this video, we're not just going to rehash old strategies. We're going to explore fresh, innovative approaches tailored for the evolving market of 2024 and beyond. Hillary's story from 1978 serves as a powerful reminder that with the right approach, significant financial growth is within reach. And now, we're here to take you step by step through the top investment strategies that can help you grow your $1,000 to a $10,000. So whether you're looking to dip your toes into the investment world for the first time, or you're searching for new avenues to explore, this video has got you covered. So subscribe to the channel and let's get started. All right, the first strategy we are going to talk about is compound interest strategy. Now this isn't your typical overnight success story. It's more like the tortoise in that old tale about the tortoise and the hare. Slow and steady wins the race, right? That's compound interest in a nutshell. Here's the deal. When you choose investments that pay dividends, you're essentially getting periodic returns on your money. Think of companies that are known for paying dividends consistently like those in the utilities sector or consumer goods. These aren't flashy, headline-grabbing tech stocks. They're more like the steady, reliable workhorses of the investment world. But here's the catch. You don't spend those dividends. Instead, you reinvest them, adding to your original investment, which then starts to earn its own returns. It's like planting a garden. You start with a handful of seeds, your $1,000. As those seeds grow and bear fruit, dividends, you take that fruit and plant more seeds, reinvest the dividends. Over time, your garden investment grows exponentially, not just from the seeds you originally planted, but from all the new seeds you've added along the way. It's like what Albert Einstein supposedly said, calling compound interest the eighth wonder of the world. He's rumored to have remarked, he who understands it, earns it, he who doesn't, pays it. Whether he said it or not, the guy had a point. This rolling snowball effect means that over time, your initial investment could turn into a sizable fortune. That's how you turn $1,000 to a $10,000 or even more, making it one of the top investment strategies for 2024 and beyond. Now, one thing we need to say in the last, you see, in today's fast-paced world of instant notifications and viral trends, Choosing to grow your wealth through dividends and compound interest is like choosing to walk through the forest instead of taking the highway. You might reach your destination more slowly, but the journey is richer and the scenery is better. So, let's put this into action. Look for well-established dividend-paying stocks or mutual funds. Use online brokerages or platforms that allow you to automatically reinvest dividends at no extra cost. This way, every dividend payment you receive buys more shares, which in turn will generate more dividends, creating a cycle of growing wealth. Sliding into our next strategy to turn $1,000 to a $10,000, we have the world of stock market investment. This isn't just about throwing your money at any company that sounds cool. It's more like being a detective, piecing together clues to find the best investment opportunities. First things first, let's talk about doing your homework. Imagine you're investing not just money, but your confidence in a company's future. Look for businesses that aren't just solid today, but have room to grow. You'll want to cozy up with their financial statements, understand their place in the market, and see how they've been doing over time. It's like choosing a racehorse based on more than just its name. You want to know its track record, its training, and its potential to win races. 
Then there's the golden rule of not putting all your eggs in one basket, or in this case, all your cash in one stock. Spread your investments across different sectors. Think of it as planting different kinds of seeds in your garden. If one type of plant doesn't do well one season, you've got others that might thrive and keep your garden growing. This way, if the tech sector takes a hit, your investments in healthcare or consumer goods might buffer the blow. That's how you turn $1,000 to a $10,000, by not letting one bad apple spoil the whole bunch. Now, the stock market is a bit like a roller coaster. It's got its ups and downs, and sometimes it can feel a bit too much. But here's where a bit of irony comes in. While it's tempting to jump ship at the first sign of trouble, history shows us that the market tends to climb upward over the long haul. It's about strapping in for the ride, not bailing out at the first loop-de-loop. -loop. Remember Warren Buffett's advice. The stock market is designed to transfer money from the active to the patient. This is the top investment strategy for 2024 and beyond. Before you dive in, take a good, hard look at what kind of investor you want to be. Some stocks are like wild horses. They can offer an exhilarating ride with high returns, but they're not for the faint-hearted. Others are more like dependable workhorses, not as thrilling, but they get you where you need to go with less risk. Aligning your choices with your comfort level and goals is crucial. So where do you actually begin? It's easier than ever. Online brokerage accounts are your gateway to the stock market. Many platforms offer tools, resources, and even practice accounts where you can get the hang of trading without risking real money. Start by signing up with a reputable online broker, one that fits your needs whether you're a hands-on trader or someone who prefers a set-it-and-forget-it approach. All right, here is another way to turn your $1,000 to a $10,000 by simply buying and selling stuff. Matt Robbs, the brains behind smart saving advice, basically says we're surrounded by treasure chests, but instead of gold, they're filled with items you can find at flea markets, yard sales, or online on places like AliExpress and eBay. The trick? It's knowing the real value of something, snagging it for less, and then selling it for more. That's how you turn $1,000 to a $10,000 by becoming a bit of a treasure hunter in the modern world. Roy Morijan, this expert from Enventi's Partners, throws another golden idea into the mix. With sites like Depop and Etsy blowing up, diving into the clothing resale world could be your golden ticket. It's not just about selling clothes, it's about tapping into a booming industry. Sure, it means putting in the effort snapping those perfect product shots, getting your online shop looking sharp, and reaching out to potential buyers. But the clothing resale world is bustling, and it's ripe for the picking. Getting started is as straightforward as it gets. Hit up those local sales or deep dive into online marketplaces to find those underpriced gems. Then get your online shop set up on a platform that suits what you're selling. The real secret sauce, being genuine and putting a bit of yourself into what you're doing. In a world full of ads and flashy marketing, a good story and an honest sell can make your shop stand out. Think of it like this, Warren Buffett talks about being greedy when others are fearful. In the reselling game, it's about seeing the potential where others see junk. It's about being smart, patient, and a bit daring. And this is one of the top investment strategies for 2024 and beyond, blending the old school hustle with the new world's opportunities. I hope this video is useful for you. If you want more videos like this, please comment video and I'll keep making them. Moving right along on our journey to turn $1,000 to a $10,000, let's talk about a real crowd pleaser in the investment world. Exchange Traded Funds, or ETFs for short. Picture this. ETFs are like those assorted chocolate boxes. You get a little bit of everything in one go, which is pretty sweet if you ask me. They bundle up stocks, commodities, or bonds. So with just one purchase, you're spreading your bets across the board. That's instant diversification, making ETFs a smart move for spreading out risks and opportunities. Now, the cool part about ETFs is how easy they are to trade. Just like individual stocks, you can buy and sell them on the stock market throughout the day. This means if you suddenly decide you want out or you want more, you can make that move without a hassle. It's like having a sports car in the world of investing fast and flexible, and they're usually cheaper than buying into a mutual fund. 
Lower costs mean you're not watching your hard-earned returns get nibbled away by fees. Plus, you can see exactly what's in that chocolate box. I mean, ETF. Because they're all about transparency. You know what you're buying into, which is more than we can say for some investments out there. Incorporating ETFs into your investment strategy is a way to get in on everything from the tech boom to the gold rush without putting all your eggs in one basket. And that diversification is key to turning your thousand dollars into something much, much bigger. That's how you play the game in 2024 and beyond with a strategy that's as much about protecting your downside as it is about capturing the upside. Warren Buffett, the Oracle of Omaha himself, often talks about the virtue of simplicity in investing and the folly of unnecessary costs. ETFs tick both of these boxes beautifully. So as we gear up to explore more ways to grow our initial thousand dollars, let's not overlook the power of ETFs. They offer a blend of simplicity, diversification, and cost-effectiveness that's hard to beat. It's a strategy that aligns perfectly with the goal of building wealth over time, proving once again that the best moves in investing are often the ones that keep you in the game, ready to capture the opportunities that lie ahead. All right, the next strategy is about real estate. Thinking about real estate, most folks imagine flipping houses or being a landlord, which definitely has its charm. But what if you could get in on the action with just a grand? Crowdfunding real estate is that ticket to the party. It's a way to invest in property, see your investment grow over time, and not have to deal with the headaches of actual property management. And since it's all about the long game, patience here can really pay off. Now, Roy Morjan, crowdfunding expert and startup advisor, made a great point when he mentioned that turning $1,000 to a $10,000 through real estate might sound like a stretch, given the usual hefty price tag attached to property investments. But here's where the game changes. Crowdfunding real estate platforms like Fundrise. These platforms are like the golden bridges for small investors, letting you and me dive into the real estate pool without having to own the entire pool. It's a bit like joining a club where everyone chips in to buy something really cool, except in this case, it's commercial and residential properties. And for those who love the idea of real estate but maybe aren't ready to dive into crowdfunding, there's another path. Real Estate Investment Trusts, or RIITs. These trusts are all about giving investors like us a slice of the real estate pie without having to buy the whole pie. They're known for dishing out attractive dividends and the chance for your investment to grow in value. Investing in REITs is like having a foot in the real estate door enjoying the perks without the hassle of dealing with tenants or fixing leaky faucets. One of the sweetest parts of diving into real estate, whether through crowdfunding or REITs, is the passive income stream. Imagine earning money without having to do the daily grind for it. Rental income can be a steady source of cash flowing into your pocket, giving you the freedom to explore other ventures or simply enjoy a bit of financial breathing space. And let's not forget about the tax advantages Real estate investments come with their own set of tax perks, like deductions for mortgage interest and depreciation, which can really sweeten the deal. It's like the government is giving you a high five for investing in real estate. So diving into real estate through either crowdfunding or REITs isn't just about trying to make a quick buck. It's about building wealth over time, getting a piece of that property ownership action and enjoying the benefits along the way. That's how you turn $1,000 to a $10,000, by tapping into the solid, tangible world of real estate, making it one of the top investment strategies for 2024 and beyond. And with just $1,000 and a bit of savvy, you're in the game, ready to watch your investment grow in one of the oldest wealth-building arenas known to mankind. Another way to turn that $1,000 to a $10,000 can be done through peer-to-peer -peer lending. Think of it as being a part of your own mini-bank, where you're the one lending out money, not the big financial institutions. The beauty of peer-to-peer -peer lending lies in the attractive interest rates it offers. Your initial $1,000 doesn't just sit there. It grows through regular interest payments made by the borrowers. Over time, this can stack up to give you some pretty sweet returns. It's like planting a bunch of seeds and watching them grow into a garden of profit. Peer-to-peer -peer lending is like walking a tightrope between seeking high returns and managing risks. The key is not looking down but focusing on the balance. By diversifying your investments across various loans, 
you're essentially wearing a safety harness. Even if you wobble a bit, say, one of the loan's defaults, you won't fall off because your other investments have got you covered. Embarking on peer-to-peer -peer lending is pretty straightforward. Sign up on a peer-to-peer -peer lending platform like Funding Circle, Prosper, Upstart, and Lending Club. Pick your loans and start lending. It's that simple. But the real magic happens when you meticulously select a variety of loans to invest in, balancing potential returns against the risks. This way, you're not just passively putting your money into a savings account. You're actively choosing who you lend to, making the financial world a bit more personal and, potentially, a lot more profitable. So it's a chance to play banker, earn interest, and potentially turn $1,000 to a $10,000 by embracing the power of the collective, proving once again that in the world of investment, thinking outside the traditional box can lead to rewarding destinations. Coming into another way to turn $1,000 to a $10,000 can be accomplished by unleashing your inner entrepreneur. Imagine that $1,000 not just as a stack of bills, but as seed capital ready to sprout into a flourishing side business. This is where your unique skills or passions can transform from hobbies into a robust source of profit. Entrepreneurship isn't just about making money. It's about bringing your ideas to life and watching them grow. Just like planting a garden from scratch and nurturing it into something bountiful. The beauty of starting your own venture is the potential for exponential growth. As your business picks up steam, what started as a small side hustle could blossom into a significant source of income. And here's a sweet twist. Depending on how you set up your business, it could even begin generating passive income. Imagine creating something that earns you money while you sleep, turning your initial investment into a continuously growing asset. Lauren Murdoch from Mainvest offers a golden nugget of wisdom here. With platforms like Mainvest, you can dive into the entrepreneurial world by investing in small businesses with as little as $100. It's like being part of a community garden where everyone's efforts contribute to the overall growth. Mainvest's unique model allows you to earn a slice of a business's revenue, providing quarterly repayments as long as the business thrives. This setup creates a win-win scenario. Businesses get the capital they need without giving up ownership, and investors like you get a front-row seat to potentially lucrative returns, all while fueling the dreams of small business owners in your community. So if you're sitting on $1,000 and wondering how to multiply it, Consider the entrepreneurial path. Whether it's launching your own venture or investing in someone else's through platforms like Mainvest, the potential to turn that initial sum into $10,000 or more is not just a pipe dream. As we continue to explore the top investment strategies for 2024 and beyond, remember that entrepreneurship offers a unique blend of personal fulfillment and financial growth. It's about making your mark, supporting others to make theirs, and potentially reaping the rewards together. And for another way to turn $1,000 to a $10,000, let's not overlook the digital revolution that's reshaping how we manage our investments. Robo-advisors, these aren't your typical Wall Street brokers. They're sophisticated algorithms designed to make investing as simple as tapping on your smartphone screen. Imagine having a personal financial advisor available 24 seven without the hefty fees. That's essentially what robo-advisors offer. What's really cool about robo-advisors is how they take the heavy lifting out of investment management. They're like having an autopilot for your financial portfolio. You tell them about your financial situation, how much risk you're comfortable taking, and what you're aiming to achieve with your investments. Then, just like that, they get to work, crafting a strategy tailored just for you, automating tasks like portfolio rebalancing and asset allocation to keep everything on track. The appeal here is twofold. First, it saves you a ton of time. There's no need to pour over financial news or agonize over which stocks to pick. Your robo-advisor handles the day-to-day -day management, freeing you up to focus on other things. Second, it's about precision. By continuously monitoring your portfolio and making adjustments as needed, these platforms ensure your investments remain aligned with your goals regardless of market fluctuations. Platforms like SoFi Automated Investing, Vanguard Digital Advisor, and Wealthfront are leading the charge, democratizing access to personalized investment advice. It's like having a financial guru in your pocket.
guiding you through the ups and downs of the market with a calm, calculated approach. Here's where a bit of irony comes into play. In an age where we crave human connection, turning over our financial futures to algorithms might seem counterintuitive. Yet by embracing these digital advisors, we're able to harness the power of technology to achieve our financial goals, making the journey from $1,000 to a $10,000 not just possible, but streamlined. With their blend of efficiency, personalization, and accessibility, they offer a forward-thinking solution to growing your wealth. Rounding off our video on how to turn $1,000 to a $10,000, let's talk about the world of side hustles. Think of it as putting your talents, hobbies, or passions to work in a way that not only brings you joy, but also extra cash. Whether it's freelancing, consulting, or setting up shop online, a side hustle adds a new dimension to your income, accelerating your path to that financial milestone. The beauty of a side hustle lies in its flexibility and the sheer variety of options available. You could be baking gourmet dog treats, designing and selling printables, or offering your expertise as a consultant. It's about finding that sweet spot where your skills and market demand meet. This extra stream of income not only supplements your main earnings, but also cushions you against unexpected financial downturns, making your overall financial strategy more resilient. Take it from Brian Clayton, CEO of GreenPal, who champions the lawn mowing business as a prime example of a lucrative side hustle. With an initial investment of less than $1,000 in some decent equipment, you could start earning back significant returns in no time. According to him, some vendors on the GreenPal platform are making up to $75 an hour, thanks to the current labor shortage. It's a testament to how choosing the right side hustle, in line with current market needs, can transform a modest investment into a substantial sum. Now, the suggestion to pick up a lawnmower and get to work might seem a bit old-fashioned. Yet, it's this return to basics, coupled with a dash of entrepreneurial spirit, that could set you on the fastest track to reaching your financial goals. So, as we explore the myriad ways to grow your initial investment, consider the potential of a side hustle. It's not just about the extra income, it's about leveraging your unique skills and interests to create something valuable. Whether it's the simplicity of a lawn mowing service or the digital savvy required for online sales, the key is to start something that aligns with what you love and what you're good at. This way, you're not just working towards turning $1,000 to a $10,000, you're also enriching your life with fulfilling work that pays. As we wrap up our exploration of turning $1,000 to a $10,000 through various investment strategies, remember that your journey into investing doesn't have to stop here. If you're eager to dive deeper, you can enjoy any audiobook for free by clicking on the link below the video. Plus, you'll find a curated list of suggested books and where to purchase them, perfect for expanding your knowledge on investing. The purpose of this video is to educate you on various aspects of investing and not to give you any specific investment advice. Investing involves risks and uncertainties, and you should always do your own research and consult with qualified professionals before making any financial decisions. However, past performance does not guarantee future results, and you should always consider the risk of investments before putting your money at stake. Now, if you find this video helpful, I recommend you watch this video next, how to live off your investments and grow your wealth in the process. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel. Also, feel free to leave your comment below. I appreciate your support and I hope to see you in my next video.